Straight now to Benin State, where Governor Samuel Otom wants the federal government to help stop the invasion of farmland by herdsmen. The governor says this will remove the fears farmers face as they get set to embark on full-scale farming during the cropping season. He stated that these were flagging off the distribution of improved seedlings and crops to thousands of farmers. Benue State is known as the food basket of the nation. It's still known by that appellation, but the amount of food produced has been badly hit by insecurity and cases of cattle eating up farmlands. Governor Samuel Autumn is mindful of this and he's here to distribute improved seedlings and crops to 22,400 farmers across the 23 local government areas of the state. Autumn says the seedlings and crops were high yielding and drought tolerant. We are going into watermelon production um, in mass, and we are, the discipline are here. This is the first efforts we have experimented and we discovered that they can do well here. And uh, we're not just looking at um, producing maize for consumption. We intend to massively produce it just like we produce soya beans. The Benue State Commissioner for Agriculture and Natural Resources Sources Timothy Iger on his part calls on the private sector to engage in the production of improved seedlings so they can be readily available to farmers. These achievements are coming despite the challenges that the governor and the government of Benin State is experiencing at the moment. So this seed program is very timely. Now that we have created an enabling environment for our farmers, especially the IDPs, to return to the ancestral homes. Those people that said that was not possible, that is what they are doing now. We want to thank you on behalf of the chairman and the management. We want to thank you for what you have done. The flag of ceremony had 4,666 improved rice seedlings, 230 bags of maize seedlings, 690 tins of melon seedlings, and 10,000 cassava stems. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.